Hi guys, I wanted to do a quick overview of the Viper ROM with S7 Edge panels. Uh, there's not a ton of features, so I'm not going to show you a lot of it. Uh, but this ROM, I've actually been running it for a few days. Uh, excellent battery life performance, is very good. Uh, it's got little tweaks in here and there. Of course, S7, full S7 Edge panels, uh, if you need the S7 Edge panels. So it will turn your phone into an S7 uh, Edge which is really cool, but you get pretty much standard Android 6.0.1. Uh, you can go ahead and install this um, on pretty much all of the Galaxy Note 5s, including the N920C, uh, the T-Mobile N920T, the Canadian N920W8. Um, for T-Mobile and Canadian, you will need to install the modified stock kernel and also install the voice fix. Now for T-Mobile, you will not get Wi-Fi calling. This is obviously because based on international ROM. Other nifty features include uh, rounded edges for recents, and also performance is decent, uh, very good. At, I got 86,730. Right, there's also a call recording. Also there's an internet meter uh, right there, speed meter up here, so you know when you're downloading stuff, um, you'll be able to actually see it. All right, so let me go ahead and type and you will see the speed meter. It's not got a ton of features, but it's a very solid ROM, very good battery life. If you're looking for something stock-like, um, also this is a DODEX ROM, so you can install exposed modules easily. Uh, this could be the way to go. Very simple, very stock-like, yet you also get S7 Edge panels, great battery life. Uh, pretty much install it on most of the Note 5s. So definitely check it out. I'll have more ROMs for the Note 5, which I've been testing out uh, soon. So check that out also. Um, in the meanwhile, stay on Android. Hi, click here to subscribe. Click here to subscribe.